So I'm Dr. Lizanne Ui, mm -hmm. and I work at the Illawarra Health and Medical Research Institute at the University of Wollongong. So, so in this um, study, we worked in a, a, I worked as part of a team. We were looking at the um, potential anti-inflammatory properties of a whole range of foods. So we looked at 115 fruits and vegetables, and also um, tea and coffee, and some mushrooms as well. The ones that showed the, the, the greatest potential, and they were most potent as anti-inflammatory molecules, um, were from um, lime, sweet potato, uh, cinnamon, also um, onions and herbs like oregano, but also I'm very pleased to say English breakfast tea. <laughs> In the future it might be possible to extract these molecules and use them as a, a medication or a treatment that can protect against the diseases. Sometimes people think that they can skip on the fruit and veg and maybe just take a vitamin pill. Um, but we are starting to identify the molecules that are active in these foods and fruits and vegetables. And it's not just vitamins, there's lots and lots of molecules and the benefits in the foods themselves, we're really only just beginning to realise.